Hey guys, welcome back to Chip Noms. It's Sinyal here. Today we're gonna make another super easy dip. So today I chose tzatziki dip. It's one of my favorite Greek foods whatsoever. And it's super, super easy to make. It'll take only like five minutes. Um, so first you'll grab some Greek yogurt. You'll want it to be whole milk. It does not have to be Chobani. It's just what I found at Walmart. Um, you'll want a lemon because we'll use some lemon juice. Garlic, we'll use one clove of garlic. Um, cucumbers, so I'll only need one cucumber. I'll shred it up before I put it in there and then dill and some extra virgin olive oil. All right guys, let's get started. Okay, so first we're gonna take um, the cucumber and grate it. The reason I have a paper towel here is because after we grate the um, cucumber, we will want to use the paper towel to squeeze out any extra water. So I'll go ahead and grate this cucumber. All right, here we have our finely grated cucumber. Again, you will wanna squeeze out some of the excess water using that paper towel. Um, next, I am just gonna go ahead and mix everything in. Um, all right, so we wanna do a cup of um, whole milk Greek yogurt. Again, I got Chobani, you can get whatever brand you want, no specific anything. So go ahead and take a big chunk out of that. I'm gonna go ahead and use my little thing just to make sure I'm not putting too much in. No, we're good. All right. Oh, sorry. Now we are going to take our lemon and I've got a tablespoon here. I'm just going to squeeze it into the tablespoon. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Maybe if it'll make it into the tablespoon, we'll see. I think about this. Okay. <laughs> this is great. Uh, if you have any better ways to squeeze a lemon and I'm just unaware, please let me know. You can comment below. I also did take the seeds out because you're not supposed to eat <laughs> lemon seeds. Hopefully you knew that before I just told you. Oh, this is gross, guys. I'm so sorry. Just kidding, that was a seed. All right, next I'm gonna go ahead and add in our dill. Um, so I did chop it up before. So make sure it's nice and finely chopped before you put it in. I do want to say I did wash my hands before I made this video, so don't worry, guys. Gotta keep the kitchen clean. All right. All right. And our last ingredient is extra virgin olive oil, which we will do half a tablespoon of. All right, I also, so I went ahead and added our um, garlic. I just finely grated it, just like with the cucumber. And also we are going to add some sea salt. I'm just gonna put a little bit just for taste. So not too much. 
and then we'll go ahead and mix it. So again, this was super, super easy. Only, I think like what, eight ingredients and in total it took me like five minutes to prepare. All I have to do is mix and eat. All right guys, this is our finished product. And to eat it with, I got some pita chips. I just got regular flavor, but whatever floats your boat, go ahead and get it. So, Let me know how you guys liked it in the comments, um, if you try it at home.